Well, you've maybe heard of telehealth when it comes to some more modern ways of connecting with your doctor or a healthcare professional. But did you know artificial intelligence, AI, is already being used in some capacity at local doctor's offices? Ryan Hermanick got the inside scoop about a new form of AI software providers at URMC are utilizing during appointments. He joins us now in the studio. And Ryan, what exactly is this technology used for? Well, Izzy, from what nurse practitioner Christina Harlem Beatties explained to me, it's not used to draw a variety away from their patient, but rather allows them to focus more on the patient's care. It essentially is a virtual scribe, which records the audio of an appointment. Afterwards, it transcribes and summarizes some of the main points discussed between the provider and that patient. This is then used when the provider submits their after-visit summary and their notes. Another reason Harlem Beatty says the tool is beneficial, aside from improving the patient experience, is it takes the burden of data entry off of providers in their networks. She explained how many providers see upwards of 20 patients a day and and trying to remember all details of an appointment after it's ended can be tricky. And of course, she says the technology has undergone extensive trials. As we're sitting in an exam room and talking about their problems, we're not looking at our computer and typing and trying to catch it all. We're instead focusing on them and their problem. There are certainly lots of other forms of AI tools in healthcare and they're being closely evaluated. We don't take it lightly that these tools need to go through pilot processes uh, to understand, you know, to, to ensure that they're going to work well for people um, and that they're safe for use. A big thing to note here, and most importantly, probably, providers at URMC are required to ask for your consent before using this technology during your appointment. And you have the right as a patient to request it not be used. When you stick with us for Newsday at 11, you'll see a demo of how exactly the technology works. But for now, Izzy, I'll send things back to you at the desk. 